Alrighty, hello guys, welcome your faces back to another video on my channel. Today we are back in Sprocket yet again, and today we're going to be doing something kind of interesting. Now, it is something that I've almost done before, um, but I didn't actually quite do it right. So, we're going to be building the Tonk today. Let's go into Sandbox and we will design it together. This video isn't actually going to be edited, uh, just to show you guys everything that happens, um, exactly how it happens. Hopefully this video is something that you guys actually kind of like. Anyway, if you guys didn't see the previous video, this is what we built. It is designed around the Comet and it was actually pretty good. Uh, it has a 76mm auto cannon, which is the weird bit. Anyway, let's go ahead and uh, new design. There we go. Awesome. And uh, let's get designing here. So we're going to go to freeform hulls. We're going to do this. We're going to go ahead and squidge this down because clearly it needs to. And we're going to go ahead and do the mobility as well because clearly we have to. So there you go. All right. So how do we actually go about doing this then? I think we need to go ahead and squidge this like so. We need to squidge this like so as well. And the separation... Oh, actually, yeah, the separation needs to come all the way in. There we go. We're going to do something just like this. Now, there are multiple designs on what people think the Tonk looks like. Um, one of them is a single track. One of them is a double track with a little hole in the middle. One of them is no track at all. Uh, sorry, no hull at all. Just a turret. Um, but we're going to go with a hull. Um, and we're going to go with two tracks. Okay? So we're going to separate them out slightly, just like this. And... I think we can actually put it in there. So, the next thing I want to do is lower this down, lower this down, make this go backwards so we can have more of them, and uh, we can do this. Okay. Actually, let's get rid of the return rollers. Let's increase the size of this guy to be really big. All right, there we go. Let's increase the size of the other guy to be really big. So, this is currently 0.79, but that's good. Uh, the sprocket, do the exact same thing. Diameter, bosh. There we go, very nice. And uh, we'll go ahead and have that there as well. And then we'll actually have more road wheels as well. So the diameter of the road wheels is going to come down. And we'll have it like this. Clearly that's not quite right, but I guess it's fine. Actually, let's add these guys back. We can bring this down into the center of those. And that actually doesn't look too bad. Yeah, that works. Okay, back to compartments. Let's bring this forwards. There we go. Let's go ahead and bring this guy forwards too. There we go as well. And we're going to go ahead and squidge it down. And squidge it in. Here we go. And I guess we got to bring it down from there too. So we're going to do this. Maybe not all the way, but there you go. Uh, bring this guy forwards. And we're going to angle that around the back. We're going to bring this guy backwards. And we're going to angle it around the front. And that's all we need to do. Okay, so grab this. Do this. Uh, and do this. Bosh. There we go. That's kind of all I really want to do. Um, but I will make it go even further by doing this. And then I will crunch it in just a little bit like so. Okay, we're then going to do the same thing on the rear. So do this. Uh, squidge it. There we go. And extend it again. And squidge it even more. And then push it inwards. Yeah, there we go. Okay, good. So this is currently what it looks like. Kind of weird. <laughs> very, very weird, actually. So extend this guy upwards. There we go. Um, that's the little bit that we needed. That's nice. We're going to go ahead and put the driver's view directly on there. So this guy is going to go right here like this. And that's going to be how we drive. Yes. Okay. That's going to go on there just like this. Epic. So now we should be able to move this thing around. Oh, it gets stuck. Oh, yikes. Okay, because um, the way the idler works, uh, if the idler touches the ground, it will get stuck. It's very annoying that way, but if we lift it up a tiny bit, we might be able to get away with it. Nah, we can't. <laughs> we, could. we actually can't get away with it. That's a problem. Okay, hang on. Uh, how would I even try and get away with this? It's getting stuck now instantly. Oh, no, that didn't work. Try again. No, that didn't work. Okay, change the transmission. Uh, did it, did it, did it. How do I change the transmission? Powertrain, there we go. Uh, clutch braking. No, this is what we want. What we've got is what we want. Okay, that's fine. Anyway, now all we need is a turret. So let's go ahead and put that on. So go to compartments. Yes. Go to freeform turrets, grab this guy, and smack it on there like so. Okay, this is essentially what we want. We're now going to select all of it. We're going to make it taller and wider, and like this. There we go. Okay, right? This is pretty much exactly what we want. We're now going to bring this up, slot it directly on top of here, and leave it like that. Okay, so far so good. Very weird though. Extremely weird. Uh, right, okay, so now that we've done this, 
Uh, I guess we just need a gun. So let's go to mobility. Actually, 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 actually. Uh, select all of the turret. Can I squidge it on the top downwards? Just a little bit. Yeah, I want it to be more round like this. That might be weird to look at, but I think it's right. There we go. Okay, leave that like that. Excellent. Okay, good. We still can't drive off here. <laughs> that still doesn't work, but it's fine. So go back to mobility. Go to tracks. Let's um, make the idler wheel slightly smaller. Uh, da, 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 da. There we go. Okay. 0.67. We're going to do the same thing with this. 0.67. Uh, like there. There we go. And leave that there. Okay. Also leave this wherever this is. That's fine. Go. Yes. All right. It's totally going to work this time. Excellent. Right, so now we just need a gun. We're going to go with a 105mm gun, because I think that'll work. And that's it. That's all we need. But first, we're going to go ahead and try and decorate a bit. I know that seems weird, but we are. We're going to decorate this a little tiny bit like so. Uh, return rollers. I guess they could look like that. There we go. Track segments themselves could look like modern ones, or modern-ish. And that'll do fine. All right, cool. So, a gun. A T-34 gun? I don't know. I don't know. Uh, maybe just this. Maybe literally just this. I don't mind if it looks, like, kind of ugly. Uh, I think it actually works that way. Um, but there you go. Okay, so cannon. Uh, caliber. 105. 105. Bosh. There we go. Propellant length. Has to be quite big. Yeah, we're going to go with quite large, actually. And we're going to go with a 6 meter long gun. Bosh. Oh, actually, that's way too long. That is, that is actually way too long. All right. Make this one longer. There we go. Add another one. Bosh, and add this to the end. There we go. Okay, good. I think that's fine. Uh, let's get rid of the muzzle brake at the end, and this will be okay. Good. So, now what we need to do is add a gunner's sight directly above this. Let's squidge that down a little bit so it looks a little bit nicer. There we go. And leave that there. So, can we see? Yes, we can. Oh, guys, this is going to be sick. This is going to be really good. Okay, so now what we need to do is go to uh, ammo storage, grab some ammo. Whack it in here. Not quite like that. Oh my goodness. Okay, like this. There we go. And splash it inside. There we go. APHE. Yeah. And APHE. Yeah. Nice. Okay, guys, we've done it. We've done it. Wait, why is the driver's port gone? Why is that gone? That doesn't make any sense. Also, it's flying. It is legit flying. Okay, put that there. And make it wider. Bam. There we go. It's back in. Go. Okay, so now we got a gun, we got the ammo, and we got a driver. Is that all we need? We need the commander's cupola too. Okay, but can it shoot? Yes. All right, we got this. Okay, so commander's cupola, let's go with this guy. And we'll slot it directly on the top in the middle, and we'll skinny it down. That's it. That's all we need to do. That is literally it. Okay, so lights, we're going to go ahead and put one of these directly above this. Squidge it down a little bit, squidge it in a little bit, and there we go. Okay. The next thing is rear lights. Of course we need those. You know? There's no way we wouldn't need those. Rear lights are important. Um, what else can we actually add to this? I don't know. I think it'd be funny to add something like this. Uh, obviously a lot smaller. There we go. But drag it in. Through there, like so. There we go. Very weird. <laughs> that is extremely strange. But we've done it. Okay, so livery is the next thing. Let's make it uh, look like this. There we go. Condition, not as perfect as you'd think. Metallic, yes. Roughness, no. Scale, quite high. Uh, saturation, quite high also. Brightness, also quite high, question mark. Q. Let's go with Q a little bit. There we go. Okay. This is our this is our tonk. This is what we're going to go with. I like it. Okay. Um, so, there are a few things that we are missing, obviously. So, fuel, we have too much. Let's go with 50. Um, transmission, we've already done. Engine... I guess could stay as is, but we do need vents in order for the engine to work. And we're going to go ahead and put that on the bottom. Here we go. So whack that in there. And whack it in there. Exhaust. This is where things get kind of interesting. I don't know where to put it. I don't know where to put the exhaust. Maybe just there. Right in the center. That is that is an odd exhaust. Like a, like a butt. But okay, sure. Right, save it. Tonk. Save. Saved as Tonk. All right, we're going to go to war. We're going to war. We're doing it. We are doing it. So, uh, I built it in early war, but we are not going to use it in early war. Uh, we're going to go on railway first. Okay? We're going to go on railway first. Hopefully this actually works out for us. 
Um, the other thing is, as well, it currently doesn't have any, um, it doesn't have any armor. It doesn't have any armor. Uh, let's go ahead and make it mid-war, and we'll make the armor thickness uh, the, the most it can be, and then we'll do the same with all of these guys, too. There you go. It's a 25-ton tank. Still not an awful lot. Oh, the engine doesn't work, though. Uh-oh. Right, engine. Yes, 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 yes. Uh, two liters each. Yep. Uh, make this quite high, and go! This is what we needed. This is what we needed. Let's go. Oh, yeah! Oh, nice. I wouldn't take this thing to war, but, like, you know, some people would. <laughs> some people definitely would. Look at its little bum. Oh, look at its little bum. Its little, um, bum hole. <laughs> it's exhaust. That's what I'm trying to say. Uh, right, okay. So, we're gonna go ahead and sit here. I see an enemy. We now aim towards enemy, and we shoot. Oh, we didn't kill it. We didn't actually kill the guy. Okay, well, we're gonna have to try. Keep shooting. Oh, I can't. Okay, right, this guy. Since this one is actually showing, let's go ahead and shoot him. Oh, no. My gun doesn't go through anything. <laughs> That's not good. I'm getting shot a lot. Oh, there we go. Man of War down. Is that guy still there? Yeah. Okay, we're gonna go for... Oh, my. There's people everywhere. Oh, those two are dead. Okay. Let's shoot that guy up there. He stopped. Oh, someone shoot that guy because he's sideways. Yeah, I got him. Nice. All right, this guy is next. It's very bouncy. The stabilization is is, is not there. But, uh, oh, I've been tracked twice. I, I couldn't move even if I wanted to. That's quite sad. It's very sad. Okay, you. I think that one's dead, actually. I think the one behind him is alive. Okay, hang on. I think we just shot around midair again. Alright, he's dead. That's fine. I can't kill him. Oh, this is so annoying. I can't even move. I can't actually even move. Is that guy alive? Yeah, okay. That guy was alive. Turn it back around. Come on. Die, please. Hey, there we go. We finally got through it. Good. Okay, there can't be many tanks left. There is six of them. Apparently, there's loads of tanks left. Okay, we just killed another one. Let's change tank. This guy does have his tracks. Let's go. Oh, he's fast too. Hot diggity dang. We're out of here. Nice. Oh, this is so dumb. This is very, very dumb. Okay, let's go round the outside. And we will shoot them from there. Hopefully that's okay. Uh, 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 can we cross the tracks here? Is that something we can do? Yeah. Nice. Okay, we can cross the tracks. Excellent. So we gotta find our way into the enemy base, and we gotta shoot the last remaining five tanks. I do have enough rounds for that. Uh, but it might take some doing. It might. Alright, let's go around. Let's get up on this hill. In fact, if we do get up on this hill, we might be able to shoot them quite nicely. Like, straight down into them. Maybe. I mean, that is... That is something that I want. But whether it's something that will actually happen, I don't know. Is that tank there alive? He's moving, so he must be. Okay, here we go. This guy. First target. Batter up! There we go, nice. I just got shot by someone else. I don't want to get tracked. Because that would be really bad. And also, I don't really want to be in the trees. Because that was that is also really bad. Let's go down here. Yes. Okay, there's the enemy. Oh my goodness. Okay. Oh yikes, I didn't see you. Or you. Oh no. Okay, I got him. Now it's your turn. Da -da 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 -da. Three, two, one. Yes! Alright, that guy shot me in the engine. That's not fun. Stop it. Victory! Da -da 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 -da. Nice. Alright, cool. We won. We actually won. Uh, what I want to do is actually get rid of a few of the people here. So the gunner is going to be a gunner loader, uh, which means we don't need the last guy. The driver can be a driver commander. Which means we don't need the other guy. So we need a gunner loader and a driver. That's it. I'm trying to use as least space as possible, but that's not really something that I can do. So maybe I should just keep it with everybody inside. Maybe. Anyway, uh, let's continue. Let's continue with this madness. All right, back out of here. Yes. We're going to go into scenarios. And we're going to go into fields. Okay. This might be where things get a little bit interesting. We'll see. Go. So there are 10 of us. I think we can do this. 
Maybe we need a slightly upgraded gun, because the gun on this doesn't seem very good. But uh, we're going to continue in anyway. What's our top speed? Currently, we're actually doing okay. We are at 45 kilometers an hour. Nice. Nice. All right, keep going forwards. Let's do this. Oh, actually, no, sorry. We need to do one more thing. Crew. Uh, da -da 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 -da. We haven't done the gun loader thing. That's fine. Uh, driver is actually going to be a radio operator too. And we're going to have a little radio. One of these. Oh, yeah. We're going to have one of these uh, on the back. There we go. I know that might be quite strange, but let's do it. So, if we go ahead and we press T, we should be able to convoy it up. They'll all get a big long line behind me, and then we can just go to war. Okay, this is a good way of doing it. Also, I feel like I should have made the tracks a little bit bigger now, but never mind. It's fine. It's completely fine. Oh, look at it. Yeah, we're going to do it. The last tonk that I made as well, I actually did do a good job too, so um, I'm happy with this. I'm very, very happy with this. Okay, so I do know the enemies spawn usually on the right. So we're going to go around the right-hand side this time. And we're going to shoot them as they spawn in, essentially. Which they should be doing very soon, because we are at the point where they should. But they haven't? Question mark? Okay, this is weird. I feel like I've got to the point where they... There we go. There are nine enemies just spawned in. We can kill them. We can definitely do this. Alright, where is it? Where are you, enemies? I need to find them. Usually they come around the right-hand side, but I actually don't see any right now. Okay, that's not amazing. I don't see any of the enemies. Oh, there they are. Okay, they're, they're actually quite far away. We've done our job. We've got all the way up to them really quickly. Okay, so... There are enemies on my right already. There are now enemies on my left. I've put myself in a really bad position here. But that's fine. As long as I shoot them in time, we're going to be okay. I can't even turn the gun. <laughs> I couldn't even turn the gun in time. Okay, turn sideways. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, that didn't work. I didn't actually get on target there. That's annoying. Okay, guys, just attack. Don't do anything else. They were trying to stay in convoy with me, which turned them all around the wrong way. There we go. All right, it's working. It's working. Okay. Oh, what's going on here? All right, they both died. Excellent. There should only be two remaining. There's one. Never mind. I'm not going to shoot him because he's... Uh... Wait, is that an enemy all the way out there? Oh, no, there we go. 12 big ones have just spawned in. That's actually kind of a yikes. I didn't think there was going to be 12. That's insane. What are they? Oh, have I just been tracked? I've just been tracked. Okay, well, I have to just sit here and return fire. They're panthers. Oh, that was too low. Higher! Come up! Too high? Okay, lower. Come on. Oh, whenever we get hit by a round, it's moving us around. Okay, I'm going to change tank. Oh, that one's also being tracked. Oh, no. It won't let me change tanks. No, really? Oh, there we go. Phew. Okay, change tank, change tank again. I want one that's already there. There we go, good. The, the way the AI works in this game is insane. It's actually insane. They just do whatever they want. Usually hang around the spawn. Very annoying, but there you go. Anyway, I don't think we've lost a tank yet. We, we actually haven't lost a tonk. Uh, not yet, anyway. That guy is getting pelted, though, so i got to get in there quickly. Let's go. I think it is Panthers, too. But we should be good. As long as we don't get tracked on our way in, I think we'll be okay. So we'll just keep driving forwards. Try and get ourselves in a nice sneaky position. Oh, it actually is taking them out, too. They're fighting back. A Panther just killed a Panther, too. Yikes. Big yikes. All right, get in there, guys. Come on. Come on, let's go. do 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 Ba -ba 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 -da -da -do -do. Come on, let's go. Let's go. It's not actually. Oh, oh, a panther just killed. Oh no, I think that's the one we started with. He died. Though the tank we started with died. That's annoying. Oh, hang on, hang on a minute. There's an enemy right here. Don't you dare kill me. It's my job to kill you. Oh, he tracked me. 
He tracked me in the hole. This is so annoying. This is actually very frustrating, the fact that we are now stuck in a hole. But, I mean, yeah, whatever. I can't even change what tank I'm in. Convoy? There we go. Oh, this one's all the way at the beginning. That's ridiculous. They haven't actually moved forwards. That doesn't make any sense. But, I mean, it's... Yeah, it's fine. Okay, keep going. Da -da 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 -da. What do you guys think of the tank, by the way? It is actually working out. We've lost two of them so far. But we have killed... I don't know how many tanks. I don't know how many of the starter ones there was. But I think around 12 tanks we've killed. And there are nine remaining. Nine tanks remaining. Look at that guy. Just sitting there doing nothing. Ridiculous. Actually ridiculous. Okay. But hopefully the enemy is actually moving this way. Because then these tanks back here that are doing nothing will actually shoot them. Which is good. So, yeah. Anywho, keep going. We got this. We got this. Also, what do we think of the livery? I actually quite like it being this this kind of green. It's a little bit different, but I think it'll work. I think it does work, even. That's what I meant. Alright, okay, here we go. There are a bunch of panthers sitting about. I've just died instantly. No. <laughs> no. The tongue is getting destroyed. I mean, it is against the panther tank, but, like, still. Okay, we took a few rounds on the on the lid. There's one up there. And there's one here. I can't quite kill them. Oh, no, they just killed that one, too. Oh, yikes. I mean, the way the tonk should work is multiple of them should be shooting at the targets. Not multiple of the targets shooting at us. You know? You know? That's what should be happening, but it's, it's just not. The enemy is just annihilating me. One at a time. One at a time. Okay. I, I think they will be making their way this way, though, so... Maybe I should just wait? But I don't want to wait. I don't want to wait. No way. No, no wait. Ha. <laughs> See what I did there? Anyway, keep going. Let's do this. Come on. So, they are moving around still. Okay, I need to get myself in a position where I can shoot sideways onto them. There are two on the hill up there. Uh-oh. Uh. He's somehow hit me in the engine. I don't know how that's even happened. All right, reverse out of there. There we go. Phew! Okay. Uh, am I... Are the guys gonna attack? Shoot? No? Nothing? Okay, fine. It's just me versus the world. I see how it is. I can't actually get through their armor with this 105mm gun either. It's not actually letting me. I can't do it. Oh, my guys are now shooting! They're doing it! They've killed one! Hey! It's working! Okay, right. Gonna reverse around here. Gonna stop. Okay, gonna start driving forwards. Here we go. Am I stuck in a hole? I just got myself stuck in a hole. I actually did. I got myself stuck in a hole. Attack. Wait, is this guy up on the hill with them? Oh my goodness! We've actually had one guy right here the whole time. Okay, this guy's side on. Shoot him. Oh, he's no longer side on. Oh, never mind. Okay, that guy's dead. It's fine. Okay, this other person is shooting at me now. Reverse out. Get out of there. Oh, yikes. Okay. Attack, guys. Come on. Uh-oh, I've got a panther coming right towards me. What? Eh? How did that happen? Are we going to win this fight? I actually don't know if we will. Okay. I missed. Oh my goodness. Come on. Come on, it bounced off. No way. Please. What do you do in this situation? Too high. I've only got like two rounds left. 
And there are six enemy tanks. There are six of them. I'm gonna get up there on the hill. I'm gonna get up there and shoot them. Come on. Drive it round. Drive it round. Yeah. Okay. Okay. At least we're speedy, right? At least we are speedy. It's all that matters. Come on. If we can get up beside him and shoot into him, that is all we need to do. Whether that's actually something we can do or not, I don't know. Alright, here we go. There are more Panthers on their way too, though. That's the issue. So even if I do get up next to this guy... Oh, he's dead. Oh, he's dead! Is that guy alive? Excuse me, are you alive? Oh, he is. I just tracked him, but I didn't actually kill him. Ah! Oh, he's alive too! I can't move! Ah! Oh, that was lucky! I couldn't move for a second. I don't have any more ammo. <laughs> I actually don't have any more ammo. Uh, Alright, this guy is kind of close, actually. Let's use this guy. Alright, there's an enemy. Can he use our speed to get up close? We didn't actually manage to do anything with that. That's a uh, big yikes. There we go. Alright, cool. We have loads more rounds in this tank, so we might be able to use this one to destroy everybody. Uh, in fact, where's this other tank? Here it is. Aim. And aim down. Fire. There we go. We killed it too. Alright, next. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. He didn't decide to shoot straight away, so that's good. Dodge. Break. It's ricocheting off him still. It's literally landed on him. Turn sideways. Shoot. Three, two, one. Yes. Okay. Two more. Two more tanks remaining. Where are they? Where? Where are they? Oh, this is going to be so annoying, isn't it? They're going to be like miles away. All right. There's one up on the hill and there is another one there, I think. Okay. So there's one all the way up there and I think there's one closer. This video has gone on for way too long, purely based on the fact that... Um... My tanks didn't all drive in at the same time. That's that's the problem. Okay, here we go. Oh, yikes. Okay, we're going to do the same thing with every single one of these, because that's seemingly working. Oh, I tracked him. But I'm now stuck. Oh, yikes. Okay, I'm stuck to this guy. I can't even reverse out. This is difficult. To get in the right position and everything, it's it's annoying. Alright, there we go, we got him. Alright, one more remaining! Hey! Who would have thought we would have got to this point? With the way it was going, it was going horribly wrong. But we've got to this point where now we've got four tanks versus one of theirs. Which means we took out absolutely, like, tons of their tanks. It's great. Like, 20. We took out 20 tanks. That's good. It might have even been more than that. I'm not sure, but like, maybe like 21? I can't remember how many of the first tank we had. But anyway, I think the last tank that we are going to shoot is up here somewhere. I have a feeling that it's behind that guy. But I'm not actually sure. We hit him, but we didn't kill him. That's an issue. Because now he's going to shoot back at me and maybe kill me. That was a silly idea. We need to get up next to it. And destroy it that way. And then we win. And then we actually win. Alright, here we go. Come on. Come on. He turned his gun back around. The AI in this game is very weird. Like, he turned his gun back because he didn't see me anymore. He forgot that I was here. But, never mind. Alright, here we go. I might do a shot on the run here. Yes, there we go. I didn't even stop to shoot him. Excellent. Alright, well, anyway. I'm going to go ahead and end this video here for now. Thank you guys very much for watching. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys thought of the unedited version of this. Um, maybe I'll do an edited version soon. I don't know. I don't know how I feel. I like doing unedited versions. Because then you see everything. But anyway, for now, thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And I'll see you next time. Goodbye.